Well, howdy, and happy Valentine's Day. It's Andy, your rock and roll shaman. I have no idea what they want to share today, but they told me to um, get this darn thing up and running, and we'll see how it goes. So, um, let's see how, what happens. <sighs> so, we're going to call upon the highest of the high, the golden Elohim, to share the messages and information that is most needed on this planet today. And of course it's going to be about love. Let's talk about love, shall we? Um, we seem to have a rather skewed perception of love right now in our society, that love is something um, that we earn, that love is something that we deserve, and love is something worth waiting for. I think all of those perceptions are bullshit. So sorry. Love is something that we find within ourselves, that we reflect to the world, and the world is able to reflect back to us. So rather than waiting for someone to find us, we become exactly who we want to become. Remember that practice irresistibility post from a little while back? Yes, yes, it's all the same stuff. We become who we want to become. We attract partners, we attract lovers, we attract friends who reflect that really cool thing about us that's going on right now. And we grow and we expand. And in some cases, we outgrow whoever is there, and then we get to go and do it all again. So it's a rather delicious process. It's a rather heartfelt process, and it takes a lot of honesty. Not everybody likes to go into that much truth. I kind of dig it. Not everybody likes to go into that much rawness of self and self-reflection, but it is the only way that we are able to find who we are, and call in a partner who can reflect that. Um, Archangel Metatron is also sharing some messages, and he wants to make sure that you know that there's not just one soulmate. So should you ever get to that place that you feel like you've had the one and um, nothing else comes, that's not true. We have lots of soulmates. We have lots of soul contracts of working at different levels to bring in different pieces of information at certain times. So there's not just one soulmate. There's many. And it can be fun and exhilarating. But from each connection, each contact, each opportunity to learn how to love ourselves more, we expand more, we give the world more of ourselves, and we hopefully learn something. So, on this Valentine's, find the ways to love yourself. <laughs> you can take that however you want. But we really want to cultivate those best pieces of ourselves and make them frickin' shine and radiate throughout the universe so bright that we draw, like moth to the flame, those who love us and can see us. Happy Valentine's. And any other day besides Valentine's, know that we still work in the same place of love. Know that it is radiant and exciting and experiential and as exhilarating as this frickin' Hallmark holiday, right? Happy Valentine's every day. If you need to find any more online, you can find me at rockandrollshaman.com. Check out the blog, watch the videos, and know that this is always a resource for you to um, give you more to help make you radiant. Have a fantastic day, love bug.